Hey, what's going on guys? It's Ninjas here, and today I'm going to be talking about the whole Hypixel ban thing. And if you don't know what happened, basically I got banned on Hypixel for doing something that I'm not really sure about. I made an appeal to really figure out what was happening. You know, that obviously won't get accepted or denied for a little while now, so we're not too sure about that. It's kind of frustrating though, because I bought a rank monthly just to get banned for a month, so I lose a whole month of my rank. You know, I can't really live stream Minecraft Hypixel for a month. I'm going to talk about what I think happened and, you know, what could have happened and what I did wrong. Basically, I got banned for um, Hypixel for boosting my account to improve my stats. If you're wondering what that is, it's basically where you take an account and you get other people or other things to start making money on other accounts to make you money, which isn't allowed. But the thing is, is I didn't do that. What I did was, is my friend and I, we were talking about making a co-op because we realized the richest players have a co-op. So we're like, well, we want to make a co-op. So we did. And we started moving stuff over slowly, but surely. And then we kind of took a break from it. And I was like, you know, I still want to just play on my solo account. So I did. But the other account was still making money. And I think that's where the biggest problem was. The sense it was still making money. It still looked suspicious. Because I'd hop on there every now and then and sell stuff to the bazaar. For when we did transfer over there, we'd have already a bunch of stuff ready. So we could get a head start and really get going. But then, you know, I log in today and I see I'm banned. And this might also not be the reason I got banned. Also, another thing I was thinking is, I use my brother's account to AFK sometimes. Whether I'm just, you know, out and about and his account's sitting in the AFK pool for my chickens, or I'm streaming for you guys and his account's sitting there AFKing my chickens. Now, not AFKing like it's killing the chickens AFK. Like, it's just going in a loop-de-loop -loop in an AFK pool. So that way the chickens can spawn and die. Which, it was how I made my money. That's how I made money, but... I don't know if that's considered account boosting, and if it is, I do apologize. I would have realized what I did wrong, and I'm still somewhat confused on what I did wrong. Once I find out if I'm allowed to tell you guys, I will go ahead and tell you guys. But another thing I was thinking is me not advertising my stream, but saying, hey, we're doing private games. I'm streaming, you know, Road to 200 subs. You should come pop in and join, and we can, you know, play private games. But I've seen so many people do that, I just don't think that could be it. And I'm not sure if any of these things are what it is. I could have done something completely different, and I'm just going crazy. But yeah, I just wanted to address you this, so that way you guys knew why I won't be streaming for the next few weeks. But this, this could be a good thing for me. I can really learn how to edit, make thumbnails, and do all that good stuff while I'm banned. So this, this could be a really good learning opportunity for me. But obviously that means the channel growth is going to be very slow and it's not going to really go up as much as well I want it to. So we're going to have to stick to things like Minecraft Survival. So we might do some more Minecraft Survival streams. Um, Valorant, Rocket League. Once I'm unbanned, we'll get back on there and really get the grind going again. But the annoying thing is, is this whole pandemic that's going on, I was really, you know, excited to get MVP++ and start grinding this out. So I was, and I was having so much fun, you guys were having fun, but now I can't get on the server for 30 days. Tragic. It's very tragic. But it is what it is. If I did something wrong, it is my fault. I take full responsibility for it, even if I really didn't do anything wrong. I take full responsibility for it. But yeah, I just wanted to tell you guys that, so that way you guys really knew what was going on. But quickly, before I go, I just want to talk about the giveaway that was at 250 subs before the end of this month. Because we were on track for that. We were going to hit that, I guarantee it. But now that the high pixel thing happened, it's not looking too likely. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to push it till the end of next month. So that way it's an extra month so we can get there. And I know we'll get there. But it's just going to take more time since this whole high pixel thing hopped on. But I also will make sure I watch what's happening a lot more and I'll be a lot more careful about it because obviously I kind of have to. <laughs> I just want to tell you guys that so that way you knew that the giveaway wasn't just going to be at 500 subs because we're not going to hit it. But we might. If we do hit it, fantastic. But yeah, I just want to tell you guys that. That way you knew that the giveaway was not a uh, complete, you know, 
goner. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy the uh, the background stuff now because I have learned how to do that and I think it's pretty cool. Hopefully you guys enjoy it too. And yeah, now, until next time.